<sighs> Alright, well, I didn't really have anything planned on recording throughout this entire week besides tomorrow, which was going to be Dragon Ball Super's uh, episode review, but yesterday so something happened, and if you don't know what happened, well, you obviously you can read the title of the screen and you probably already saw it like all over Twitter, all over the internet so far because this is fucking huge. This is huge, especially in the Dragon Ball fan base. I, I, I have, I don't, I had no words to say other than Hiromi Sudu, the original voice actor for Bulma, since the very first episode of the Dragon Ball anime, and has been doing it for over thirty years since uh, since Dra Dragon Ball up until Dragon Ball Super passed away yesterday and I I, 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 I I don't know how to take it you know like at first I saw someone tweet out a name but I didn't really get a good glance at it to see who it was so I just kind of you know just kind of dismissed it I didn't really give it all that much of thought uh, I wake up uh, later in the next morning which is Friday uh, and then I see Geekdom's uh, stream, and it was a tribute to Hiromi Sudu, and it was the voice actor for Bulma, and I, I don't know, I, I just, the whole fan base is freaking out right now. Everyone's em emotionally affected by this because this, <laughs> this is, this is Bulma, you know, this is the original Bulma. This is the person that has been doing Bulma for years and years and she's 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 gone. She's fucking gone. And I I don't know what else to say other than just rest in peace, Hiromi Sudo. And even though you're gone, you'll never be forgotten. You put a lot of smiles and laughs for children, teens, and even adults throughout all the years that Dragon Ball has been around. You've been around for many new generations of the fan base for Dragon Ball, and now... I, I was watching Geekdom stream, I, I swear to you, I almost fucking cried. I almost just fucking broke down and cried. I, I, I don't know how else to... To fucking put it into words of how emotionally affected I am by this, but um, just I I don't know. This video is not going to be monetized because I don't want to gain any monetary value over someone's death. But I just wanted to give some j just some quick words for my own personal thoughts and of how I personally feel affected. I just, I didn't want to take too much of anyone's time. Uh, enough people already in the fan base are, you know, extremely upset that this happened, but I'm just going to go ahead and lead the video off with a moment of silence. Uh, yeah, I'll see, see you guys in the next video.